The curves here are equal potential lines with voltages labeled. The scale for this map is shown here. A. Draw direction of electric field at points A, B, and C. B. Rank electric field strengths at points A, B, and C from high to low. C. Estimate the magnitude of electric field at point B. The direction of the electric field is always perpendicular to the equal potential surfaces. And if we follow the field lines, the potential should go down. Now the potential goes down lower that way to the left. So it must be perpendicular to the equal potential surface and that way. Perpendicular, perpendicular. Part B. We have to rank the strength of the electric field. The closer the equal potential surfaces, the stronger the electric field. So th these lines are farthest apart, so that means uh, the field is strongest at A, and then it's B, and then C. And then we have to estimate the magnitude of electric field at point B. Now we don't have uniform electric field over here, but uh, near B over here, the equal potential surfaces are almost like these equal potential surfaces in uniform electric field. The equal potential surfaces are kind of parallel to each other and almost equal distance apart. So if we just need to estimate the magnitude of the electric field over here, we can treat this region as a uniform electric field, which means that we can use V equals to ED. Since the electric field may not be really uniform in this region, I'm going to use this part. That includes space to the left of point B and to the right of point B, hoping that the averaging of the two sides can help me get a more accurate magnitude of the field at point B. So the voltage across this region is 0 to 10, so it's 10 volts. And that equals to E times the distance right here. And I have to use the distance that's perpendicular to the equal potential surfaces. And if I make the measurement of this scale, and I can see that this distance is about twice of this much. So the distance D would be 2 times the point zero zero four. And this will give me an electric field that is uh, 1,250, and the unit will be either volts per meter or newtons per coulomb.